What's up guys, this is Steven on my third video. Today I'm going to be talking about something else about Naruto Shibuden. I'm going to be talking about the, I'm going to be talking about the 1 through 10 Tales Jinchuriki and their beasts. Okay, I think first up on our list is uh, honestly my second favorite. The Tail Beast name is the, the Tail Beast is the One Tails is the One Tail, and their and its technical technical name is Shikoku. Shikoku. The owner, the owner of the t the 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 Ten Tails, nah, not Ten Tails. The One Tails owner is Gara, which is a sand type shinobi. Okay, next I'm gonna be talking about the two tails. The two tails name is the two tails name is a well the two tails is a blue tiger. Is a basically a blue tiger. Still got the black stripes and everything, but it looks like flame instead of just stripes. The two tails name is Matata Matatabi. The two the two tails the two tails that Jinchuriki is Tukato Ni. Next, we'll talk about the three tails, which is basically a water style beast. This water with this water style beast is best looks a little bit like a clam, but I would say I would say more like a uh, like a crab or something like that because he doesn't have his right eye. I think it's because of uh, incident he got into earlier in the future, earlier in the uh, past of Naruto Shippuden. The owner of the yeah, the owner. Of the name of the three tails is Isoba, and the name of the own the name of the three tails Jinchuriki is Yagura. Yagura, yeah. The four tails is a is basically a gorilla. No, it's no nothing. Get, it doesn't get more simple any more simple than that. The name of the four tails is Son Goku. <laughs> Wait till I mention that later in the Dragon Ball in the Dragon Ball Z, ser Z series. Anyway, the name of the foretell Jinchuriki is Roshi. <laughs> this gonna come up. That's gonna come up for Dragon Ball Z too. Anyway, the five tails. Name the five tails is a horse with five tails. Has a bit of has a bit of an eye problem. Has a bit of an eye problem since the bottom of his eye is. Since the bottom is, of his eye is like I think red and blue, but it's a straight white horse. I've never gotten that. Anyway, the five tails name is Kokuo. Sounds a little bit sounds a little bit like the end of the one tails name, which is Shikoku. The five tails Jinchuriki is Han. Huh. He sounds a little bit like some of huh. Anyway, the six tails is kind of a blob. And he will be my not fourth, third favorite. He'll be my he'll be my third favorite um tail beast. Scratch that he'll be my he'll be my uh first favorite my uh third favorite uh yeah he'll be my third favorite tail beast. His name is Saiken. It sounds like something off of a uh drone movie or something like that. Okay. He, the name of the name of the six tails and shirk is is Udakata, which is in which is in my opinion my favorite uh Jinchuriki. My favorite my favorite Jinchuriki. Mostly because most because of the fact that he can blow bubbles and pretty much get out of any situation. Okay. The seven tails is a dragonfly who has six, who has three tails sticking out of each side of his back and the last tail is uh, sticking straight down. I think that's to re I think that's to keep balance. I think that's to keep balance in his uh in since he's really big. He also has a really big mask come going on like like I think he's a what's the name? I think he maybe something like related to a knight. But yeah. Okay, the name of the uh, seven tails is Chomi, Chomei. In the name of the, in the name of the, yeah, the name of 
uh, the seven the seven tail of Denturki is food. The eight next we're going to the eight tails. The eight tails is is probably my second favorite beast. Yeah, the eight tails is my second favorite beast. And mo mostly because mostly because he is awesome. He's an ox with eight. He's an ox with eight tentacles. I mean, come on. And then he rhymes. Come on. He, the name of the eight tails is Gayuki. The name sounds pretty funny. But so, <laughs> but so does uh, Shiko Shikoku. Yeah. Anyway. The eight tail Jinchuriki it is Killer B. Killer B is my uh, Killer B is my <coughs> second favorite my second favorite Jinchuriki. Mostly because most because he rhymes and then the fact that he's really good with blades, which is in my favor. Okay. <laughs> I just thought about something. <laughs> okay. The nine tails. Okay. The next. Next we go to the nine tails. The nine tails is a. The nine tails is a very or is an orange demon fox, who is very much a hater. In my opinion, he doesn't like anybody, and he and he is sealed away inside of Naruto. But you see, but if you watch Naruto enough, you see you see that killer bee was the killer bee. And the eight tails help Naruto, help Naruto um, yeah, control the control the uh, nine tails. You can see that he also finishes off the nine tails with a wind style rising shuriken. We go on to his name. His name is yeah. The nine tail name is Karama. Karama, in Chinese. The the not the not tail Jinchuriki is Naruto, which ba he's basically the main character other than Sasuke and Sakura. Uh, he he is my third favorite Jinchuriki. The nine tail that now the nine tail the nine tail has three, has three Jinchuriki. The first one is Naruto, and then then before Naruto there were there was two. The Cherokee. Two people that were able to unlock the Nine Tails power. But neither one of them did it. Because neither one of them had the power to. Anyway, the first one with the uh, name the name of the two uh, Nine Tails unlockables were the Nine Tail Yen Jin Cherokee and Nine Tails Yang Jin Cherokee. The Nine Tails Yen Jin Cherokee is Minato Nami yeah, Namikaze. Namikaze. He is the father, the father of Naruto. As the father of Naruto, he is the uh, he is what's called he is the Yin Jin that the Nine Tails Yin Jin Cherokee, the Nine Tails Yang Jin Cherokee. Uh, give me a second. Yeah. Anyway, the Nine Tails Yinjin Cherokee, the Nine Tails Yinjin Cherokee is Minato himself. Now the Nine Tails Yangjin Cherokee, I don't know him. I'm gonna do some research on him today, but that's the Nine Tails Yinjin Cherokee. The Ten Tails, the Ten Tails Yinjin Cherokee. I've been I've been waiting to get to this one because the Yinjin Cherokee is my favorite. The Ten Tail doesn't have the Ten Tails doesn't have a specific name like the other, like the last nine. But he is the most powerful out of them. You see that later in the Naruto Naruto Shippuden series that he had nah. You see it later in the Naruto in uh that nah. Jesus okay. You see later in the Naruto Shippuden series that the one tails, two tails, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine tails have to team up along with the Jinchuriki to beat the ten tails. They are. Uh, both teams formed the both teams formed a tail beast bomb, but the not, but the one through nine tail tail beasts ended up winning because they theirs they combined all theirs into one. Okay, the ten tails, oh, the ten tails Jinchuriki was Mara Madara, 
Uchiha. I was really surprised about that one. I thought, honestly, I thought it was Toby at first. Then I thought, then I uh, realized that it was Madara. Because he had the, because in Naruto, in Naruto Shippuden, Ultimate Storm 3, I remember the video game. I remember in the video game, he had the, uh, what's the name? In the video game, Toby, or as Naruto would say, the fake Mar the, uh, the fake Mara. The, he had control. He had control of the. Uh, he had control of the. Uh, the two three. The two through seven tail Jinchuriki. He had control of the tail beast forms as well. When they when they got too slow, when they uh started getting too slow, when Naruto went in, when Naruto transformed into the nine tails. I remember Karama saying that it was that that mode wasn't perfect, so it wouldn't last for too long. Immediately when he had beat all seven of them, well, all six of them, my fault. Immediately when he beat, immediately after he beat all six of them, Toby, or Fake Madara, said that said that it would be too risky to send out. It would be too risky to send out the um uh, the uh Jinchuriki again. So he decided to fight Naruto himself. Those when he those when he summoned the the uh, ten tails. It chained the Jinchuriki back up, which was which was basically a sucker move in my in my opinion. But yeah, that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Again, guys, this is Steven. Subscribe below. Make sure you comment me on what you want me to talk about in shows, and I'll see you next time. <sighs>